Hi, I'm Nancy Lynn Ruth with UnblockResults.com. And I haven't, uh, it's going to sound odd. You know how we've all been talking about how excited we are to get out in the world. Oh, things are opening up again. I can't wait to get out and go out to eat, to meet with friends, to hug people. I, and yes, to all those things. I want all of that. Uh, but I've also noticed that I've got a little bit of reluctance about going out, which doesn't make a lot of sense. Uh, for example, you'll notice my, my hair is really long, really long. And it's, um, it's been 17 months since I got a haircut because my husband and I decided early on that we were not going to put ourselves in any place where we didn't have to be uh, as long as uh, we and our daughter were not fully vaccinated. Well, guess what? We'll all be fully vaccinated by Thursday evening. And I thought, okay, I should schedule my haircut. Great, I'll go do that. And I actually put it off a little bit. Uh, I put it off and I... Um, uh, Put it off again. I put it, well, I finally did get it on the schedule, but it, I realized that I, this isn't the only time I've been reluctant to do things, and I'm not the only one. Now, if if you're all excited and gung ho and out, let's go. That's great. This is not for you. But if you find that for some reason you're kind of holding back and not wanting to go out and do those things that you've been wanting to go out and do, this is for for us. Okay. So um, let's tap. I don't have a script for this. I just want to tap um, together on reluctance to get out there, whether it's for um, doing networking in person or um, being in public, um, whatever it is, I'm going to keep it pretty broad and pretty general. Feel free to tap along with me. And then if you feel like there's something specific coming up, go ahead and jump off and tap on your own. But this can be a really good starting point to let yourself explore it and then start to release whatever is holding you back. And just so you know, it really isn't that unusual. Um, we get, get used to, we get comfortable with where we are. Even if it's not a comfortable place, some part of us is happy to be there because it feels like it's uh, where we need to be. It feels like uh, it is... Uh, keeping us safe and alive. So anyway, mm, Facebook keeps trying to tell me that my frame rate is too low, but I'm going to ignore it because I just want to get to the tapping. Okay. So you're tapping with me about as hard as if you were drumming your fingertips on a finger uh, on a tabletop. Uh, and if anything hurts or is not comfortable, skip that spot. Okay, here we go. Even though I'm not sure I want to really get out there now. Repeat what I just said. I deeply and completely accept myself. Even though I'm just not comfortable going back to the way it was. I deeply and completely accept myself. Even though I'm not sure I really want to get out there. I deeply and completely accept myself. What is wrong with me? The world is finally opening up again. I can go do all those things I've been wanting to do for over a year. And suddenly I don't want to do it. What is that all about? Why don't I want to go see people, get out there and network in person? Why don't I want to be out in the world instead of behind my computer? It doesn't make sense. But somehow I just don't want to get out there. And I know I'll go out. I know I'll get out there. I'll do the networking. But I'm kind of 
of dragging my feet here. What is that all about? Actually, it's some part of me trying to keep me safe. It hasn't been the best fun to be stuck at home for all this time. But I've survived. And some part of me says, oh, this is the way to survive. So it wants me to stay safe, to stay home, to not get out in person. I honor that part of me. And yet it's time. I know that I'll be safe. I won't take foolish risks. And I know it's time. It's time to be out there where other people are. To talk to other people. To live more fully. And it might be a little tough at first. But I can do this. I've done it before. I can do it again. I just need to get my toe back in the water, maybe jump in feet first, and then it'll come back to, to feeling normal. And I can do that. I can get out there. Okay, take a deep breath in, let it out nice and slowly. That's a relaxation technique too. So that really was just an off the cuff approach to tapping about not wanting to get out there. And you know you better than I do <laughs> and, and better than any, any video could possibly capture. If you know that the reason you're not wanting to get out there is because you feel like, you, oh, I don't know, maybe you gained weight and how will they react to me? Well, you can tap directly on that. And just so you know, people will love to see you. Doesn't matter if you've gained weight. Okay. Um, or maybe part of you is like, well, I don't know if it's really safe after all. Um, nothing's ever fully safe, but you were doing this before. So go ahead and let that out. I don't know if I'll be really safe. I don't know. I mean, what about variants and what, whatever tap while you're saying those fears and yes, actually go to the negative side of it while tapping and see how they shift and change. Because once you address them while tapping, it allows you to breathe deeper and say, huh, yeah, that, yes, there is always a, uh, some form of danger out there, but that doesn't mean you stop living. Okay. Or, or however your, your mind is going to, to change as you think about this and as you tap on it. So anyway, that, that was just a, uh, a quick approach to tapping for any reluctance you have to get out there. I hope it's useful. If you've got any questions or if it isn't enough, if there's something else going on that you really feel like is going to keep you from doing what, what's next for you, reach out. Let's talk about it. You can direct message me or you can email me, nancy at unblockresults.com. Let's see what's going on and see if we can't do a little tapping and release it. All right. I hope that was helpful. I hope you could even see it with the frame rate. And until I see you again, happy tapping.